Hello everyone, I am Jashwant and I am here to describe the security issues and solutions of wireless sensor networks. The research paper I chose was published in the International Journal of Computer Application in Volume 162 in March 2017. very first i will describe what is wireless sensor network wireless sensor networks are domain specific wireless networks that means domain specific designed for the special purpose wireless networks that are designed for a special purpose are called wireless sensor networks it applies embedded system technology to wireless and the packet transformed over the network are bidirectional that means packets can be transformed in both directions over the network have low communication bandwidth that means a very low amount of data is transformed over the network they consume very low power because the devices attached to a wireless sensor network have low power and low memory therefore the wireless sensor network consume very low power uh, i think uh, a battery is attached to it for power and uh, what actually wireless sensor network does wireless sensor network helps in monitoring physical or environmental state and they help gathering information from physical world like uh, environmental state means temperature or pollution or something else they gather such information from physical world with the help of sensors wireless sensor network can be used on ground as well as underground and underwater now what are sensor nodes the devices connected to the network are called sensor node and each sensor node in wireless sensor network is connected to many other sensor nodes and now what is central node central node can be considered a controlling device that controls all the nodes and every node collect data and pass data and send it to the central node okay after collecting the data they pass the data means they perform operations and then send the result to the central node that means central node is connected to every other node this is a basic figure about uh, wireless sensor network and uh, this is following zigbee scheme we will talk about zigbee later what is zigbee and uh, what is zigbee scheme but this is a basic figure about the wireless sensor network and this helps and in understanding wireless sensor network how the sensors are uh, connected and how these are connected with the central node and then how the central node is connected with the help of GPRS to the server now what is the main purpose of the research paper which I chose the main purpose of the research paper is that wireless sensor networks are being used in all over the world that is true this helps monitoring the environmental state as we discussed a minute before that uh, this helps monitoring the environmental state so this is used widely in weather forecasting uh, whether in city or forest or uh, this is used by security forces to analyze the threats 
and there are many more applications of wireless sensor networks there are some security issues and wireless sensor networks because it is being developed so attacks are also modern because people are finding a new way to attack the wireless sensor networking and that scientists are finding modern solution to tackle that attacks so this is one of the solution which uh, which is provided in this paper now let's understand the architecture of wireless sensor network the architecture primarily consists of four units what are those four units one is sensing units that contains the sensor the other unit is processing unit this processes the data with the help of microcontroller and store the output in memory the communication unit the communication unit have devices to generate signal and transceiver to receive it also the power unit the power unit is uh, basically a battery that uh, supplies power that's it either battery or any other source but the function is just to supply power now if we see below we have a chart that is showing that how the architecture of wireless sensor network works and there is a source battery that provide uh, power to the wireless sensor network then there is a transceiver that receives signal and send it to the microcontroller microcontroller process it and store the result in the external memory device the external memory device is connected when the microcontroller doesn't have enough memory to store the result now microcontroller send it to the idc for further processing characteristics of wsn now if we talk about the characteristics characteristics are what make wireless sensor network different from others like devices and wireless sensor network configure themselves they are able to configure themselves in a network their nodes have lack of storage and power because uh, they are very small in size a node can easily be damaged due to uncontrollable environmental conditions the node in the wireless sensor network are basically weak therefore they can easily be damaged due to uncontrollable environmental conditions and uh, wireless sensor network is application specific as i said before they are specially designed for a purpose um, data from other nodes communicate to the central central node means every node send data to the central node and data communicates from the central node it consists of devices that vary in size and power and heterogeneity of nodes heterogeneity of nodes means that uh, every node is of different type rarely there are same nodes but usually the wireless sensor networks are of different type of nodes now what security issues we face in wireless sensor networks nodes are deployed densely therefore they have a close relationship with environment can easily be physical tempered now as we discussed that uh, a little uncontrollable environment can damage the sensor node and they are deployed densely densely means uh, they are deployed as if they may not appear 
so they have a close relation with the environment so a little change in environment can damage a whole wireless sensor network attackers can access the node and steal information because uh, nodes are not physically monitored therefore a attacker can access the node and steal information either physically or remotely wsn is monitored remotely as i said a minute before so a physical attempt to attack may go undetected due to unreliable wireless medium the wireless medium is a unreliable medium cannot be trusted because the information from a wireless medium can easily be stolen attackers can target transmission without disturbing the network that's true wireless sensor networks are bi directional that means the data can transfer from both directions between the nodes and uh, then conflict happens that means uh, when packets meet in path the conflict between packet can occur because this supports low bandwidth so this is also a security issue code for security algorithm must be small because the node have a small storage capacity the code for uh, securing the node must be small cause that does not support more storage capacity and uh, because the replacement of uh, nodes cost high therefore the nodes cannot easily be replaced after deployed and power must be conserved served to increase the life of a network that's uh, that's obviously true because uh, the more power a network have the more it will function especially in wireless sensor network because they are uh, powered by a, a type of source uh, that is not connected to electricity right like a battery or any other thing so power must be conserved in wireless sensor networks now what type of attacks that may be made to attack wireless sensor network 